Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial on TestLink from rcvacademy.com. In this tutorial, we will learn about linking the test cases to the requirements in TestLink. So, as uh, from the beginning of this tutorial series, we have been going uh, or we have been trying to correlate the test link functionalities with the software development lifecycle functionalities. So that is why we started with the requirement management section of test link and then different aspects of the requirement management and options available for requirement management in test link. Then we went to creating the test suite and test cases. And now in this tutorial series, we'll see uh, how you can link the requirement to the test cases uh, and get the traceability for the requirement now having the traceability in any of the test project is very much important because it gives you uh, the visibility of what coverage uh, of the requirement or what's the coverage uh, of testing for the particular requirement in uh, the project and you can get the traceability only if you link the test cases to the requirements um, and that gives you a clear picture that for this particular uh, requirement how many test cases are being linked to it uh, associated to it and what is the execution percentage of those test cases so that gives you a clear understanding of the coverage in terms of um, the test execution and the quality um, confidence as well now there are different options different ways wherein you can um, uh, link the test cases to requirements so we'll cover some of the ways uh, so on the home page if you go to the requirement specification section um, and in the requirement specification if you want to link some of the test cases to particular requirement just select the requirement and in this requirement you will see this coverage section available right now to link the test cases to this particular requirement simply click on this plus sign and you can start providing the numbers so test case one and click on save and that particular test case will be linked to the um, this particular requirement okay so now if you want to add another test case so test case two for example uh, just provide the number and click on save so now you can see these two test cases have been linked to this particular requirement all right now coming back to the first requirement if you want to add another uh, test cases to it so just say simply um, test case 5 is linked to this particular requirement uh, and that particular test case will be added to or linked to this uh, requirement 1 uh, the other way is uh, to to link the requirements is go to the test case itself so go to the test specification and say for example for the checkout test cases i want to link some requirement right so now in this section if i just click on the requirement uh link here okay and simply just drag it here and now on this page you can see different requirements available right so if i just want to link these test cases or just this test cases uh, to requirement three just select that and click on assign okay and now this particular test case will be assigned to requirement three just close this window and now you can see registration functionality requirement three has been linked to this particular test case similarly if you just um, uh, go to the, to any other test case uh, you want to link you can simply select the uh, test case and again click on this uh, little icon to link or unlink the requirement if you want to unlink the requirement simply go to the requirement and just click on this uh, little icon again and select the uh, the test case and unassign okay and that particular link will be removed okay so that's how you link and unlink 
test cases to the requirement and linking and unlinking or linking the requirements um, linking the test cases to requirement is very much important in the testing project because it gives you a clear understanding and traceability of the coverage of the particular requirement or how much coverage or how much testing has been done for that particular requirement so i hope you like this video uh, please do share and subscribe thank you for watching